Hello guys, welcome back to another City Skylines video. It's another custom build video actually. Uh, it's been a while. I mean, it's been quite a lot of time since the last uh, custom build video. And I was thinking, why not go for something else? Uh, actually, the reason behind this custom build video, it's more or less, uh, let's say, um, the issues that we had, I had uh, with all, most of my save games. Um, after I installed my windows and everything on my PC, but anyways, everything is fixed now, Arndorf is back on business as you saw it, and plus I wanted to do something extra. Uh, again, I miss this kind of video. In today video, in today custom build video, guys, we or you are going to see a rural, 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 how do you pronounce this? A rural, rural road uh, build. Uh, how to detail it? Quite a lot. I mean, you can take this video as you actually want to. Um, hopefully, the most important thing here that you can take from this is the inspiration. In a way or another, I kinda use quite a lot of um, props. Uh, decals and props and decals plus some uh, props and decals and again uh, maybe some trees and bushes uh, so uh, if you are going to do something like this then you might have to prepare yourself for some really ni nasty FPS at a point and of course lots of props and um, decals use or you can even add, add them as a let's say procedural object I didn't want to add procedural objects uh, for two reasons uh, one of the reasons is that well it's a custom build video you know and I don't care about the <laughs> prop limit and the second reason was well because I didn't need it actually because um, I'm using only some assets here uh, decals here sorry not assets and no need to change their aspect or something else so they can be used as simple simple uh, decals nothing else uh, so one of the steps let's take it uh, step by step i cut a lot from the time lapse in order to for you guys to see what i'm actually doing and to inform you or maybe give you some ideas uh, oh yeah, I just changed the color of the road because I felt uh, we need a more darker color for the asphalt here. And uh, adding lines is the most important thing, of course. And here I am just lowering them with help of the moving mode in order to make it look more realistic. Because you know, uh, all the lines in real life don't, they are not like perfectly done, like they were just draw right now on the road by those who do this so i'm lowering some of them a little bit more some of them a little bit less and so on to be a kind of difference between uh, their color so some of them are a bit fade away some not uh, as well with these ones uh, with the dotted lines as well uh, again it makes it look a bit more realistic because after all that's what i'm trying to achieve uh, here I'm adding some uh, other type of decals. Uh, these are some uh, road wear, as you can see in the Find It um, tab. There in the in the Find It tab uh, search bar, uh, those are road wear, and these are some damage decals, uh, which help again to have a really really nice uh, road aspect. Uh, again, I've been, I'm doing this actually in many other builds of mine and videos and some of you, some of the people who see this on my uh, Instagram account. By the way, you should check out my Instagram account. Uh, I'm posting there twice a day or at least, or not at least, at most, sometimes only once. Uh, here I'm propping some cracks, some really nice cracks made by uh, McWell, McWell I'm sorry, uh, I have a problem with his name right now. Uh, really beautiful cracks, I tell you that, these are twice as best than uh, the ones made by Ronix. Well, because some of them are made now and some uh, a long time ago. Anyways, I was thinking about the Instagram account, so you should follow me there if you wanna f see what I'm actually doing and you wanna see pictures from my builds and whatnot. 
I'm hitting right now all around 1k uh, followers on Instagram, which is really cool. And thank you guys for that. Uh, someone else just also um, created a fan page, a Skip It fan page, which was funny and interesting from my point of view. No one did that for now. And uh, thank you to the creator of that fan page. Uh, it's easy to find it as well. It's fan page Skip It. If you just uh, type there in the search... Um, area for um, Instagram and uh, what rural road is that without electric electricity poles right we need electricity poles these are some wooden electricity poles uh, right next to the road to give it a more sexy and beautiful aspect uh, to the entire area and to the road itself actually um, I don't have a collection. If you guys are wondering, I don't have a collection. You can ask me stuff in the comment section if you want to see or if you want to know about an asset or a decal or something. Just ask me about it. I can help you with that. Um, for instance, I'm using here a little uh, a uh, guardrail only for that side and that's because I'm um, on the other side of the road uh, not on the one where I added the electricity poles I will be adding a let's say bike path don't ask me where this custom build video or uh, not video where this custom build or this rural road is like what country or something I have no clue but there are roads, lots of roads, especially in the Netherlands. Again, I'm not copying Netherlands because the roads are too bad for Netherlands. They're, the roads are really good. Well, if I have to say it um, from the road aspect, we can go for uh, something Eastern European or uh, maybe even Italy in some bad places. But because of the bike path, well, I don't know what to say. So I'm adding a bike pathway on that side. Uh, and I will surrounding, uh, I will surround it uh, with lots of uh, bushes, uh, grass, and uh, whatnot, in order to make it look really good. Actually, really, really good. I will um, add a, I would, I will add asphalt. Uh, as you can see here, asphalt, uh, probable asphalt, because over it. So uh, I can make it almost in the same way like the road wanna be. Even the road is a bit um, less grayish or uh, brighter than this. Well, that's just because I had a lot of decals on over the road, and um, well, it is, in my opinion, the contrast between the two, um, well, the pathway and the rural road. It's quite interesting. You'll see after I will add the bushes and trees and the grass, and the grass it will look even uh, better. Um, I'm using this um, brush to uh, take away or to get rid of the pavement and then the gravel. I'm adding also some little extra um, damaged decals which I'm lowering down with the moving mode in order to fade them away so we can you can see just a tiny bit you know just a tiny tiny bit the only thing I didn't do and I kind of am sorry right now if I have to think about it it's I should have uh, lowered the speed of the cars uh, driving on these roads because if you think about it the roads are pretty bad and you don't drive that fast unless it's not your car maybe <laughs> it's a car from uh, the place you work um, and here are some potholes made by also uh, McWellish McWellish come on I forgot his name um, adding them also on the road and the bike path and uh, whatnot Hey, nice draw I did there on the <laughs> on the asphalt. But those cracks are definitely super super good looking. Um, I was thinking even for a second to release this uh, save game on my Patreon account, but then again I said maybe now and it's interested to to see it. 
bus, I have to make a collection, and that would be really uh, quite a lot to do. Um, so, for my Patreon followers, sorry, no release for this one. I will be releasing very soon the uh, save game for Arndorf now that I managed to fix uh, the save game. Actually, the save game to fix the save game is a bit too much said because. There was not a mode causing my issues, there were some assets. I don't know which assets were causing the uh, issues for Arndorf, but um, it was really bad. I wouldn't... I was like, nah, it's not an asset or, or, or something like this. Nah, it's a mode. Nope, it was an asset. As soon as I subscribe to all everything that I had before for Arndorf, the save game worked. And I found out that there is an asset because I was working on a new series, the one called Arnfeld, which I don't think it will be like a specific series, a, a separate se series. Uh, after I made, I created a collection only for Arnfeld and unsubscribed from stuff from Arndorf and from extra other uh, assets that I had subscribed. The save game didn't work, it was exactly like Ardorf, uh, only some uh, nasty things, instead of roads there were only some grey um, shadows maybe? And I was like, what happened? And then I said, okay, let me subscribe to everything, because the only thing I did was just to unsubscribe from some assets, and as soon as I did that, it worked. And when I saw that it worked, I was like, oh. Hoppa hoppa hoppa! If it's working, then maybe I should try to see if Arndorf is working as well, because uh, it might be the same thing there. And yeah, I was happy like a kid. The first thing I did after I fixed Arndorf was to start recording one. So if you guys didn't see, two days ago I just posted another video for Arndorf. You should go and check it out. It's really uh, a short story, but but nice, I did a uh, wild overpass, a highway, so you should go check it out, uh, especially if you are loving that. And for extra, let's say, uh, decorations and extra look, I, I added here a very very old airplane, which looks like it, it crashed here, uh, maybe near those rocks. Those are just some uh, little rocks, stones, whatnot. Uh, so let's not imagine that the plane crashed into that big rock and make it into very small pieces. Nah, I, I, at least I wasn't thinking of that. And also added here like a little little crane, which manipulates those uh, old logs. Well, again, those are also a world old. Plus, I'm adding here lots of uh, weed. <laughs> weed, right? Uh, some weeds. Weeds, I mean. Weeds. Yeah, weeds. Escape weeds. For God's name, man. So I'm adding some lots of weeds here um, <laughs> to make it look uh, more interesting and uh, better uh, and sexier. We are getting very close to the end of this uh, sh this custom build. I, I was about to say short custom build, but actually it's not that short. Uh, the cinematics are going to hit us uh, very, very, very soon. But guys, thank you so much for watching, uh, you should go uh, and click on that subscribe button if you are new here. Uh, if you are not new or you are just an old uh, skibber, how I like to call you, uh, don't forget to hit the like button and of course leave some uh, comments, I'm uh, anxious to see if you guys are happy, as much as I am, by getting back with some new custom build videos. Uh, because you know what, uh, if you are, then I can make more. Uh, I have a plenty inspiration right now for this kind of build, so why not? Uh, but anyways guys, uh, today it should be Wednesday, so maybe the next video will be tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. I, will, I might record some foundations. And Friday, of course, I hope we should see each other again for another Friday night with Skip, a new live stream from Nant. But guys! Thank you, you are awesome, go check out my Patreon account and Instagram, and see you next time, I salute you.